Hello students, now come to the first exercise of this chapter, exercise 8.1. In this first question, write T for true and F for false. Now, a point has breadth, it's true or false. If I put a dot here, is there any length, breadth and height? Suppose dot A, point A, is there any length, is there any breadth, is there any height? We can't measure the length, breadth or height of this point with the help of scale. So there is no breadth. So it, a point has breadth, it is a false statement. I will write false. Okay. Now, a line segment has a definite length, a line segment. Suppose a line segment, let me draw like this, A, B. Since it has two end points, means either it starts from A and ends at B, point B or it starts from end B and uh, end B and starts and sorry it ends at point A so it can be measurable so we can measure the distance between these two points so this is what a line segment and it can be measured so a line segment has definite length means we can measure the length length of this line segment so it is true but if it is line suppose line it represents that the point A it is moving endlessly towards this direction right now it is left direction and this in the end B is moving towards in this direction that is right right hand direction endlessly so we can't measure it because there is no starting and end point so from where we will start the measurement with the help of scale or any measurement measurement, uh, measurement tape so for a line we can't measure the length but for a line segment, we can measure it because it has two definite endpoints. So we can measure with the help of any scale the length of the line segment AB. So it is true. A line is a part of line segment. A line, suppose MN, a line is a part of line segment false because the statement should be like this a line segment is a part of line because we can take out a line segment this portion a b this portion we can take out and we can represent here so we can say this portion it is line segment is a part of line but line is a part of line segment is a false statement okay so this is a false line it should be line segment is a part of line okay now a ray can be measured how it can be possible see in a ray there is one point starting point so from here you can measure with the help of scale suppose this is your scale this is zero then it's more in this way one then in this way two suppose you will place your scale in this way you can start measuring here you can start with zero but where you will end because since there is no end point this B, this point B will move endlessly. So how can you measure it? So a ray also, you can't measure ray. You can't measure line, but you can measure the line segment. Okay, is that clear? So in case of point also, you can't measure it. You can't measure the length, breadth or height of the point. You can't measure the length of the line. You can't measure the length of the ray, but only you can measure the length of the line segment. Is that clear? So I hope you understood this part. So a ray can be measured. Sorry, it is false statement. Okay. So this is very clear. Need to clean. Okay. Thank you.